Here we're looking at an interactive simulation for a ternary phase diagram that has a phase envelope. And what this means is we have phase separation. So over a certain region, and first let's look at the link here, tells us where we can find this simulation. And if we look at a snapshot of the simulation, this region surrounded by the purple and orange lines corresponds to the region where we have two phases. We have phase separation. And so, for example, for the point indicated by this black dot, that point consists of two phases, one with this overall mass fraction composition, the other purple point with this overall mass fraction composition. If I move this black dot along the dashed black line, I don't change the compositions. This is a tie line. What I change is how much we have of each phase. So where it's located currently, we have much more of the purple phase present. And as we move it to the left, we'd have less and less of the purple phase and more and more of this orange phase, the alpha phase. So let's look at this interactive simulation. So here we're in the one phase region. Pure A is at the top. We move this dot up. You can see we have more and more of A. Way over here is pure component C. And we can read the compositions for a ternary diagram. If I move into the two-phase region, and let's say we're on that tie line, then we're showing the compositions of each phase. I can show the grid lines or remove them. I can remove the tie lines to make it less complicated. I can remove the composition of the alpha phase if you want to test yourself as to what the composition is, or the beta phase to make sure you understand this diagram. So the purple line corresponds to the beta phase, and the orange line, the alpha phase. We have a point where we switch from purple to orange. This is the plat point. This corresponds to the transition, so we we draw these tie lines. Well, this is where we, as we keep drawing a tie line, we're connecting the alpha and the beta phase. This is where the phases become the same composition. This simulation also has a diagram just to make it clear. This is the one phase region. This is the plat point I mentioned, alpha phase, beta phase, and then this is the two phase region. So the, the idea of the diagram is hopefully by moving this around the point composition around, you can better understand how to read these ternary phase diagrams where we have phase separation.